social media, we need to be very careful. Hmm. In fact, careful indeed. Yes, careful indeed. very, very careful, careful with what we say, with what we post hmm. all the time. People, some journalists, some people posting nonsense here and there, they will not take their time to find out and confirm what really happened before they start posting things. Hmm. My greatest fans are the children, so I don't play with them. Hmm. They were the one uh, pulling their parents to watch hmm. the show. People know me with this character. I should not let even if everyone is going to fall. Keep that name. Even if the producer is doing this to you, if um, uh, people are doing this to you to lose the character, don't allow. Just keep that name because there's a house name. Household. That, household name. That God has given you. Not only that, but you speak English to your children. Even if, as a father, if your uh, father is speaking English, mother must be able to speak uh, the local, language. the local language. The local both, dialect. Oh, yeah, the local dialect. Both will be running. We are not saying that women should not work. They go to work, come back, and do what you are supposed to do. And your husband will know that, yes, you are a good wife. Move to go, move to go. What will be, will be. If you are going to die today, hmm, hmm. it must surely happen. Hmm. If you are going to live for 200 years, it will happen like that. I want you to be me. Ben, sir. Ti won ba ni fe nkan to nse. Hmm. O ye ki o ma dupe lo won. Eyan lo ma gbe esoke. Ben, sir. Eyan na lo ma la e mole. Last two days, there are people were saying that Papa just goes there. If it's free nkan, what do I do? It's not smoke. So I just, I woke up and I said, Papa just go, but this is, Papa just go, ah, God. I thank you. <laughs> Sabi Africa. You have mentioned it. Now you Sabi. That's right. Say I don't die. That's why yes, sir. you called me here today. To Mashiwa. And you are relevant. Hmm. You should always thank me.
It's another very wonderful, special. This is a special edition today on Asabi Africa. A very, very wonderful, special edition. As you can see, the atmosphere is charged. Today is Tuesday, the 17th day of January, year 2023. And we have a very wonderful, extraordinary personality in the theater room. A man of impeccable achievement in terms of comedy business and in terms of cultural ambassador for Nigeria, for Lagos, and for the Yoruba race. Uh, well, something happened last son, uh, Sunday. There was a breaking news that uh, Papa Jasko is dead. Papa Jasko is a very famous comic star, comic art in Nigeria in the Wally Adenuga series of the 90s, 2000s, and all that. And when the story broke, everybody went haywire. It was almost like it was a blockbuster news everywhere. People were concerned, people were disturbed, people were calling, making calls. The world just is passed. But to the glory of God, it was not the real Papa Jasko. It was the standing personality who happens to be, his name is called Mr. Femi Ogurumbi. We console and we come with his family. But the real actor, the star man, the man himself, the real character, that is Baba Jasko, is Mr. Richard at Biodun Ayoyinka. And to the glory of God, all over the world, people have been asking, and he himself has come out to say, wow, I'm alive, hale, and hearty, and I'm still fully loaded with my ass. And everybody is celebrating. So it's between celebration and uh, consolation and all that. But for the fact that we are lucky to have some people around him, and we have to beg them, we have to re react quick. So we got him, and by the fact of God, it's not easy to get him by because he's a very busy man. And uh, that is why this edition is going to be a wine edition, a wine encounter with the real star, the man himself, the real Papa Ajasko, Mr. Richard Abiodun Ayoyinka, sir. Happy New Year to you, sir. I wish you the same, no my brother. Sir. And to um, my fans out there, who <laughs> jibi 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 jibi. <laughs> <laughs> this you studied on jubilization. That's right. <laughs> the whole world was scattered from Africa to Europe to Australia to America. Everybody was asking what happened. What happened? Baba Jasko is dead. But to the glory of God, Baba Jasko is not dead. But before we start, this is a celebration edition. It's called Wine Encounter with Baba Jasko. And since we have ojibijuginized it, sir, we are starting it with a wine celebration and uh because it's a new year. Well, as time goes on, we are going to have uh, maybe another company will name their uh, a wine. Ojibi to be wine. It's like just Chando. Well, it's a sparkling red grape fruit uh, wine. But Ojibi okay. wine is coming. It's coming. And maybe it's coming. all of them that are in the wine business, Baba Jasper has declared that we're going to have a company you can create Ojibi Jibi Jibi wine. wine. And the ambassador is here already, so you have a good wine. So we we are toasting to long life and happiness. Wow! Wow! Let me just make it as real as possible. God bless you, sir. So we start we start by serving you first. Oh, it was. A burst of happiness. Yeah, yeah. A burst of prosperity and a burst of good life and good health. And joy. And joy. It's okay now. Okay, it's okay, yes. Maybe I'm not a good wine server. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. We are so happy to see you today. I'm you happy know, to you see you too. You can see the way the streets. Everybody's yeah, they were just reacted, calling, me the, calling you. The they, were there, was too much. they were calling you Okuti, Okuti. Okuti and I was like, is it, fair? Is it Anikola Okuti? <laughs> <laughs> Okuti Laja. <laughs> oh, God. Well, we are celebrating today. Before we start the interview, it's a celebration of good life, happiness, and joy. That we are with the real Baba Jasku. Abedun, Richard Abedun Ayoyinka, the man 
that Okuti Laja, mm. you can have your cup, sir. Yeah. yeah. Toast to good life, sir. Toast. Toast to happiness, sir. That's right. Toast to long life, sir. That's good, and man. Toast to unlimited joy in year 2023. Amen. Thank sir. you, my brother. A round of applause for them. Mm. Everybody is Let's start by asking that how did you feel when you had the news of your death, but you are not the one? Ah. <laughs> uh, for that very day, hmm. very early in the morning, hmm. where I met the shock of my life. Hmm. Seeing Papa Jasko, people started calling here and there. Are you alive? Are you this? I said, I am alive. I am not dead. So I really wanted to confirm. So I uh, opened my phone and then uh, got straight to uh, Facebook, mm. Facebook, and then um, Twitter, mm. and, um, Instagram. Instagram. Ah, and I begin to see all these posts. The Roger School is dead. And later I, I, I discovered that he's uh, Femi Ogurumbi. Mm. That was the man that took care. Uh, 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 my position when I travel out of uh, the country, and I say this is so it's very Why? Mm. But why are they? Why are they putting my picture there? Mm. That means in the, mm. social media, we need to be very careful. Mm. In fact, careful indeed. It, yes, careful indeed. very very careful. Careful with what we say, with what we post, mm. all the time. People, some journalists, some people posting nonsense here and there. They will not take their time to find out and confirm what really happened before they start posting things. Mm. Even, um, um, I would say Baba, Jakaban, Tinubu said it, that the problem of Nigeria is social media, which I believe. Mm. Look at this one that happened. They were putting your picture. Picture. Instead of the guy's picture. Even some people too, did it in another way by putting my picture yeah. one side and then put uh, his own picture the other side and they put it together. Can you imagine? What are they, they are playing on, uh, on people's intelligence. intelligence. I, I don't know. And just not the their emotion. But I know it's the work of the bloggers, you know. Yeah. I know and I'm not ready for them. Yeah. And um, say you want to sue people and then you want to do that. It's, it's, it's it's not, there's, yeah. it's, there's, there's no need. Just educate them. Educate them, and I came out to say, I am not dead. I'm still alive. The, the, the force of the news push you out of your out of my <laughs> distance, and I said, okay. Comfort. And I said, ah, this is a, I, from Monday tonight, I started receiving, receiving calls. Hmm. Uh, calls. Okay. They voted yesterday. Yesterday, 16th of January. Even this morning, I received some calls too, hmm. asking me. What is the key? What is that? I said, it's okay now. Uh, don't worry. This thing almost scattered my family. Jesus Christ. My Jesus hometown, Christ. the king of my, oh. my, my town. The king, the paramount king of your town. Of my town. What happened to him? He came to our house and to, 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 to ask her, hey, because I'm from he the came, He you came know? down. He came down with to ask, to, yes, with the center to my house. Uh, uh, so I was told. And I know they will not lie. To, to, ask, find, out. to find out what is, whether uh, uh, Papa Jansko is dead or not. <sighs> so this country, we really need, because we overflow things <clears throat> out of, um, I want to make money, I want to do <clears throat> this. I want to make traffic. Traffic, sharp, 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 sharp. No, most of them don't wait for God's work. Hmm. What will be, will be. Yeah. For Mr. Femi Gurumbi, yeah. I know he uh, happens to be a friend of mine. Because I was going to ask that, what is the difference between Richard Abiodun Ayoyinka and Femi Gurumbi? What's, I mean, a lot of people, when you left that time, some of us that were watching that program, to be honest with you, and this is not because I'm seeing you here, we stop watching. So some of us, majority of us, and that's the perception of a lot of people in the studio here, majority of us didn't really have a, a clue of him really we didn't even know of course we saw him once in a while until when he this thing happened now so what's the difference between Abiodun Ayoyinka and Femi Ogunumbi? Uh, uh, Abiodun Ayoyinka um, and that's yes, your humble self sir 
my humble self, I, uh, well, I'm an actor. Anybody can be an actor. Mm. But I know Femme Gurumbi because uh, we both went to University of Ife together. Oh, Unifair. Yes, Unifair. That's your Obama University. Uh, <laughs> and uh, he studied music. He's a musicologist. Mm. So uh, we worked together for several times, severally. Um, we attended festivals mm. together. He was at the National Troop, you are the State uh, Troop. The State Troop. At times, the State Troop will invite him. If you have any chora during any competition, he will come and package it for us and all that. When he now uh, took a student for Papa Jasko for at least for maybe a year or nine months, I, I welcome him. He did well, but people didn't accept him. Because that that's Papa Jasko's cool style. You know, I have yeah. my own style, yeah. he has his own style. Yeah. That's just it. But but I want to ask, was there a kind of uh, because when it happened then, I think I was in Fame magazine then and uh, there are a lot of stories some of us wrote, of course. It was a breaking news then that there was uh, what can I call it? There was uh, under, misunderstanding between you and the man called Wale Adenuga, the owner of Pepsi, the, the, the owner of the story. Some of you wanted to sell that credibility, I mean, do other things. And he, being an Ijebu man, God forgive me, he decided to be himself. And he brought in those people thinking that, oh, to hell with you and all that. But did he create bad blood between you and Femi Guru? No, 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 no. At all. At sure, all. Sir? Oh, sure, sure. How did he handle it when he took over your role? And he knew that, well, it's your role. Eh, uh, well, well, what is going to happen? Because I know this world. Mm. And it's always like that in the, in the theater world. Mm. Or the same team industry and all that. Mm. We have a man playing uh, uh, James Bongo 07 when he died, another person uh, took over. And it happened so separately. So, uh, in the absence of a particular actor, another person can take over. So that doesn't mean anything to me. But as I, I wish, it didn't really touch me that time. Mm. Uh, that, ah, Papa, just, just now that someone will come and replace you. Mm. And I said, well, if this role mm. is meant for me, it will fine. not go away. It will not go away. It will come back. And I relaxed. Mm. That is a, a bit philosophical. Yes. Like you have some philosophical yeah, maturity. That's right. And I realized later, we resolve the whole issue. Even the disease. <laughs> and well, we spoke and said, Papa, just come and take over your role, please. Because people uh, always uh, uh, harass him outside. Even the children, they will say, ah, you, are not, you are not the right person. You are, you are, you are, you are, go. Uh, to the point of you know stoning him and all that. <laughs> so when we thank the Lord, all these things. Yes, I know. It's God's work. It's God's work. Mm. I mean, I mean, what, what what I noticed with that episode because I've also we have few videos. I've also seen you at different occasions, different full. I mean, especially children event. I mean, the way they run after you, the way the euphoria, the man, the, the, the sense of euphoria, the sense of uh, gratitude, the sense of appreciation. I mean, the fun. The, the, the fun credibility is just with you. Will you say this is a work of destiny or a work of strategy by the artist? It's the work of destiny. Mm. And I would say it's the work of God too. You, if you are destined to, to become a star, <laughs> definitely mm. you will do. And, and my greatest fans mm. are the children. I notice that. That's why if I need to I attend children's program. I don't fail them. Hmm. Hmm. I, I told you now. I tell my guru be on the street. Now it was the children that was, you know, uh, clamoring and say, "I know, when you don't want to you go." I know that. So, my greatest fans are the children. So I don't play with them. Hmm. They were the one uh, pulling their parents. The worst hmm. issue because there's no way you will not. Uh, uh, satisfy your children. Yes, sir. If they say they want to go and watch Papa Jasko, at times uh, most homes now, you know, they'll say, "Okay, Papa Jasko is on." Ah, mommy, daddy, go and on the generator. 
<laughs> That's a, a extra money for the parents. And so it's like that. Oh. So my general fans, all the biggest fans, mm. are the children. The children. Mm. The children. And by, uh, by, 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 by standard, the parents now fall in love. Yeah, they'll fall in definitely. <laughs> they they fall. want to pull their <laughs> parents because the parents need to satisfy their children. Mm. I want to ask a very deep question and I want to plead that you will. Uh, you, you will react to this because that's one of the things we begged your PA and your agency when we were begging for this interview that when Wala Jiruga decided to sack you then, how did you feel? And uh, because some of us had sympathy for you because I was, some of us, anyway, not myself alone, some of us in the media uh, industry were like, this man already had the identity, you yourself and Boy Alinko who happens to be a friend, he's now in America. And then Miss Pepe, yeah. but you are the leader of the pack. Then Pa James too is there, you know. So then he said, because oh, you did this and you did that, but it didn't affect his pause. But how did you feel that time? How, what, 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 what did that experience teach you about life, about people, and about business? Ah well, a lot. Uh, when uh, when the thing happened that year, I felt bad. Uh, that time there was nothing I could do. Hmm. Just to take it Just as an take actor. It on your stride. As an artist. It's because um, um, if you are good in so many things as a theatre man, if you don't do this, hmm. you do that. Hmm. I work with Lagos Seekers for Arts and Culture. I sing, I dance, I choreograph, I drum. So I had to fall back to my office. Jesus Christ. Professionally. Mm. The career part. The career part. Talk in terms of culture. Showcase the culture of Yoruba or Hausa Igbo anytime, any day. Mm. Mm. So this uh, Papa Jasky was saying, okay, that one is just, it's an outside work. Mm. But I was employed as a cultural officer. Mm. So I am good at that. So that time, I fell back to my office and said, okay, fine. People will say, ah, uh, he's now very much well, Let him do it. It's, 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 it's life. Mm. It's part of the it's process part of, of life. Of life. There's nothing one can do about that. Mm. So I just said to myself, okay, let's see how the whole thing will end. Mm. Then I begin to see uh, different reactions, different uh, talk here and there that the guy uh, cannot be like Papa Diri, Papa Jasko, yeah. and okay. all that. If they accept him, mm. nothing I can do. Yeah. If they didn't accept him, that means I have to go back. The force but, of the force of destiny. Yes, the force of destiny. Mm. Until the youth now. Resolved between I and uh, uh, the producer, Mr. Wala Dinuga. And we continue up to now. But how did you got the strength to forgive him easily? Because Sabu Wala said, Well, you messed me up, then walk away. Me, 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 I don't keep malice, you know. Yeah. Once, uh, if, if I'm annoyed with a friend, and then we sit down and you know, talk, it over. Issue, talk it over, and that it ends there. Life continues. Yes, of course, now. Yoruba will say, Arema Jekon, Arema Jekon, Kosi, Ahon Ati, Onja, Oga Tomoshino, Aja. So, Yoruba will say, Pariye, Otononye. Arema Jekon, Kosi. Arema Jekon, Kosi. I'm sorry to say this, but they say, they talk about Gwai 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 or something like that. They talk about Gwai Gwai Gwai. I'm not going to hear the Bashiri. If I keep malice with you for life, don't play on this one, I keep malice with him, then you'll be alone. You'll be alone for life. Huh. Exactly. That, that, that's, exactly. A big, that's a big one from you, sir. Uh, as at that time, when you now went back and everybody started falling in love again with the series, mm. how did you feel with the viewers? And uh, uh, I mean, the Nigerian, the, the, did that also teach you a lesson when you went back into your role and you started interpreting? Because it appears that the your late friend couldn't interpret that character properly. So when you are not back to job, how did you feel then? Ah, 
I'm very happy, I'm very happy. And I, it was that time that I said to myself, don't let it happen again. What's the meaning of don't let it happen again? Leaving the role. Hmm. Hmm. Don't let it happen again. Leaving the role. Hmm. Because I know it's a strong role. The character that is very strong. And people the dominant know, character. Yes, people know me with this character. I should not let even if everyone is going to fall. Keep that name. Even if the producer is doing this to you, if um, uh, people are doing this to you to lose the character, don't allow. Just keep that name because there's a house name. Household. That, household name. That God has given you. Hmm. Your own brand. I had that voice. Okay, you have the voice. Hmm. A divine voice. That is your own, it's like almost like your own gospel. And I. And I oh, this is a good one. Let's listen. Let's listen to it. Fashola, Wale, Adejo, Ga Production. That's uh, that's my Nigeria list. number one. Who oh, more my chance is the best person? Best person. Papa just go. Papa James. Best person. Yes. Uh, yeah, so uh, yes. That's interesting. That's no, interesting. no. Let me just offer so that I know you can pick it. No, no, no. Don't worry. No, um, the, the song is an interlude. It's an interlude. <laughs> <laughs> you know, in those days when we had that song, everybody's running. But, oh, uh, on Jebel, on Jebel, on Jebel. We running the children. I'm saying, mommy, go and run generator and do that. And over 20... Those are good old days. Yes. Um, we started 1997. Huh. Up to date, which is about 25 to 26, 26 yes. years now. We celebrated uh, the 25 years of Papa Jan's school. That was um, last year. In uh, this, uh, is it not uh, October or August or so? Yeah. So, can you it's, imagine? It's, it's um, quite a long time. So, I wouldn't want a situation where I will lose that character, hmm. whether I am making money with it or not making money with it, hmm. or whether I am worthy with it hmm. or not. Hmm. Let me still keep my, my identity. Name, identity going. Nice one. Mm. Not doing bad things with it. Mm. Can you imagine? Because naturally, I hate um, doing bad things. Mm. You, are, you are an ambassador of morale. Morale. L let's right. even. You, you don't want to spoil the world. Yes. I mean, in your own days, you raise children with strong hand, discipline, and you make them to see life from the perspective of the Holy Bible, exactly. the Holy Quran. I mean, the good culture of the Yoruba people. Yeah. But today now, you see a whole lot of young stars. I mean, over tattoo their body to start with. I mean, somebody opened his arm, everything is blemished with tattoo. So it's, then somebody is a male, have earrings. Earrings and all that. And all that. Then a male doing all sort of odious, eyes not sipping things and all that. Then to add sort of injury, smoking, and they celebrate the smoking publicly. And uh, I mean, to the extent that an artist can even go to a club and want to date a, 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 another man's wife and shot a gun, and the police are looking for him and he ran away. Now, what do you see to this generation of artists? I mean, it's usually about an artist is telling people that they should go and call Lord Sherry Chua. And when he was coming to stage, he came with pussy and all that. As an ambassador of culture, Yoruba culture, and a good ethic enthusiast. How do you feel, sir? Well, um, I always educate people that Nigeria, we have our culture, our tradition hmm. is gone. Okay. Like you mentioned now that um, you know, men tattoo, putting, using earrings, you see their body, even the way of dressing of our young boys and girls nowadays. Thank God, our university today just uh, copped it and said, dress nicely. Yeah. You see the body. God gave you this body. Yeah. I don't know. Why are you exposing your body unnecessarily? It's not part of our culture. Yeah. It's not. Then, then we now begin to um, follow foreign culture that is spoiling things for us in Nigeria which is very bad. 
Nigeria is hard. Many people will because many people can afford a good Ankara. They would dance. If you go to Katangua, they have you see burn down slate and all that. Yeah. Eh? They will buy something that will expose their body because mm. they want to they want to belong. They want to belong. Wrongly belong. Wrongly belong. <laughs> Which is mm. very bad. So uh, our culture and tradition is dying gradually. But you have the National Orientation Agency. What is their job? You, in your own agency, they're, they're, they're you use dance, you use culture, you use uh, Lulabi and all the rest yes. to pass a message. Yes. But what do you think the National Orientation should do so that people can hear the right news, the right um, uh, public yeah. opinion? Uh, well, we've started already. And then I think uh, uh, our culture and tradition will begin to... Um, show in uh, schools now like mm -hmm. in any school and they want to do cultural day and all that and they always attend and enlighten them that let your children dress properly let them know how to cook what is called we do it's not only that where you speak english to your children even if, as a father, if your uh, a father is speaking English, mother must be able to speak a, local the, language. the local language. The local both, dialect. Yeah, local dialect. Both will be running. Hmm? So it, there's no way uh, mommy and daddy will start speaking uh, English always. Hmm. And they will not. They are from somewhere now. Yes. We are just praying that uh, there will not be war. In, in Nigeria, do you understand me? Mm. Eh? Hmm. If there's war, it happens in in the north. They will just ask you, hey, you know, you know, you know, you know that was uh, uh, the last war. The yes, wars and all. Yes, things. that's it. That one, if you can't answer, how say will kill you? And if you get to Igbo and they speak to you in Igbo, I mean, you can't answer back. Eh? Not to talk of your back pay, pay, mommy, in I don't. They will finish you. So all these things, they are, they are very, very important in, in, in our society. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's not everything that uh, foreign culture or foreign tradition, the way, their way of dressing will come and spoil things uh, uh, for us. It, it's not good. Our mothers are not like that. Our fathers are not too, like not that. Like that. Really fathers. This, yes. I, I mean, it's in a generation whereby if you kill your child, the child reports it to the police in London, uh, America, and they come and pick you home. Uh, I mean, in our days, you will be killed, you will be, be punished. You will be punished. You want musiga or uh, They will deal with you, and the morality will sink into you. Into to you. So, but today now we have children that are, you look at the video the other trending whereby a boy was abusing someone in a train station in London, a small boy of maybe nine years old, abusing an adult, and there's nothing, talking down to nothing her. They could do to nothing they could do. A lady to another video, a lady was also abusing the woman somewhere and he said, you can't slap me, you can't slap me, you know. Then, uh, is it uh, uh, the other lady, Maria, uh, there's a lady that spoke to a lady in America, I think uh, it's an author, that author, that popular female author that said, you must respect me, you must add Mrs. My name is Mrs. I say my angel or something like that. So when you see all these things happen, do you think it is the role of the parent that is failing or the role of the church that is failing or the general society? Or oh, the government. The so government yeah. Where do we classify yeah. this kind of thing? I always ask myself that question. Hmm. Like uh, here, if you bought a boss now and then standing you know, position is there and you see an elderly man, hmm. Standing. Standing. And you are sitting for And a young man is sitting coming in a bus. You cannot. It don't be, all these things, they happen during my own time. When, when we are happen. growing up. And yes. it will never you happen. Tell the old, the old come man, and come and see. Or the old woman, I want joku. I want joku. Because. And that one will bless you. It, 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 without even uttering it. Uttering anything. The, play, the blessing will be on your head. But they say, no, no, no. It's my spray. It's I my spray. I can't do hey, that. Hey, you know, I know. And then uh, most of them, they just speak like a, a, an American, which is not is another thing entirely. We are not saying that you should not mimic them when when the time comes. But mm. our dialect, the way we speak, shouldn't change. Mm. The way we speak, term, yeah, the way we speak, yeah, shouldn't change. Our way of dressing, the way we cook, even some of our children nowadays, they get married, mm. and after uh, six months. And the husband discovered that 
she cannot cook. Of course, many occasions, many, many. She cannot even many. watch yeah. clothes and all. Managers that. are breaking on that rule. Even side. apart from she doesn't even know how to take care of a child, of, of a baby. A, of a baby. Yeah, bad. Hmm? We are not saying that women should not work. They go to work, come back, and do what you are supposed to do. And your husband will know that, yes, you are a good wife. All these things, let's go on. How, how, do, how, do we, how do we bring those days back? In your own days, you know? How do we bring the days of fearful parents and well-behaved children? I mean, the days whereby, of course, you want to do your thing, but you listen to your parent. You, 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 you. Baba saw, he has saw, then Ogbo saw, then she don't feel she, or she shit it here. Uh, to the Bible said, in our days, nobody speaks about the way we feel about things. You know, it's a line of one of his songs, question of faith. How do we bring the good days? Is it the school we're going to give this job to, or the church? The church is looking for money to build cathedral. The school is also everybody selling handouts in the school. The teachers are doing some jobs by the side because the oh, salary it does not take them to the bus stop again. Their take home pay does not take them to the bus stop. Then the society itself that everybody is chasing. Vanity. Well, I, as an ambassador of the culture, that's why I wanted to put it to them. Um, I, think, I think we'll just go on educating ourselves. Mm. If you get to church, even the church is worse. Mm. Their mode of dressing, the worshippers and all that. And if you go to schools too, mm. so many places like that. But I think if we begin like this and begin to educate ourselves, go to schools, go to churches and then educate them that this is how to dress, this is how to behave normally. I think things will work. Yeah. But it's not in the hand of anybody except the hand of God. Hmm. In the hand of God. In the hand of God. We have to call into God and to redirect us. Yes. Hmm. Uh, uh, before we go to cultural issue, let's, let's, let's go by the beat. Uh, the experience of hearing about your death, what's the biggest lesson it taught you about life? I mean, when you had and you woke up and you are opening your phone and uh, there are news on blogs, on uh, on platforms that you, are, you have passed away and unfortunately it was just the other character that stood for you. How did you feel, sir? What is the lesson that has taught you? Ah, great lesson. Hmm. Because, and I know, that what would be would be. Hmm. What would be would be. Move to go, move to go. What would be would be. Hmm. If you are going to die today, hmm, hmm. it must surely happen. Hmm. If you are going to live for 200 years, it will happen like that. Hmm. If it happened, uh, uh, last two days, that people were saying that Papa just goes there. If, if it's ring call, what do I do? <laughs> <laughs> it's called smoke. So I just I woke up and I said, Papa just go. But this is Papa just going ah, God, I thank you. God, I thank you. Yeah, thank you. You look at yourself. In anything in life, you must always thank your God. In any situation. Hmm. So other things. Minor, but there are things that you need to correct, and that was what I did after listening to people receiving calls and all. I said, Let me just tell people that I am not dead, mm -hmm. and explain to them that it was the man that took over my role when I was not around, which I did. Yeah, and I, and so I thank God too. If I this is your first interview, major interview. We had one breaking it because we have to go through almost for the eight hours begging your agents to please allow you to come and all that. So how do you feel on a Sabi Africa? We were the one to call you first to talk to you and to let the world know that the man is alive, kicking, and he still has some good 50 years loaded in him. <laughs> Sabi Africa. <laughs> you have mentioned it. Now you Sabi. That's <laughs> Say I don't die. That's why yes, sir. you called me here today. Yes, sir. So, and, and, and I believe that you sabi everything. Amen, sir. <laughs> both our culture, the tradition, and what is happening in this country, mm. both uh, in politics and yes, all sir. that. Mm. Yeah, yes, you know? uh, we all know there are great uh, politics you know, going on in Nigeria yeah. now. We're in the political year. Yeah, the political year. And uh, very soon we are expecting uh, 
another president. It changed so, of button. Yeah, change of button. <laughs> from red to yellow, <laughs> maybe from yellow to blue. We don't know yet, but we just pray that whatever, let mm. us uh, ask God mm. to, give, to give us the best. To give us the best leader. Best. Mm. Best. And that's it. Obinizabe say, Baba, only God that can show us the way. We all know what's and the situation in Nigeria. Mm. We are still in a very horrible situation. It's not the thing that one start discussing. You know? Just to put everything in the hands of God. But we need a better president. Good president. Mm. I know that. So and God will answer. By God's grace. We don't want to take you there. But let me ask you again before going to the application. Between acting, Papa Jaskoro, and dancing for the truth that you control, the Lagos truth, I mean, Controlling that troop, that beautiful troop. Which one fascinates you more? Which one do you like most? <laughs> <laughs> Find yourself in the sets. I mean, with everybody, oh, the spirit, everything. First of all, I would just say, I like stage productions mm. than TV productions. Because I was trained as a stage actor. Mm. All the way from Efe, that was 1983, 84. Nothing like, you know, uh, series. we didn't experience that, uh, mm. television series and all that. We are trained on stage. So I love, I, I, I love stage productions and then the, the culture of Nigeria, mm. you know, and all that. So uh, I've been in it for a long time. Mm. I've been in it from, uh, from 1985, hmm. that I've been working with Lagos, the Council for and Culture, you know, showcasing the culture of Lagos and Nigeria. That's good, 33 years. Yes. Hmm. 33 years now. Hmm. Not even 33, it's 30, 37 years now. 37? Yes. Jesus Christ. Now. That's a long time. Yes. So I've been in it. Um, acting. Okay, sir. That one is different. Hmm. Playing the role of Papa Jasko is a different thing entirely. That I still, apart from the culture or the cultural whatever of Nigeria, um, acting is a different thing. Yeah, you know, acting is made believe. Yes, sir. Uh, that yes. you can take this role and people will believe that you are doing it well uh, as an actor. So it's quite different from my office work. Hmm. As an Carry an uh, art officer. Yes. <laughs> I'm struck. You analyze it so well, and uh, I didn't know you didn't go for one. You, you I know with the city is the one I love the most. Oh, no, 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 no. But, uh, but, but well, <laughs> well, you know, I started with uh, yes, one. Yeah. <laughs> Before joining the other, so it's all that. It's all about talents and all that. About talents. But the next question people were expecting to ask you is that: Can we have the renewal? the return of Baba Jasko and Company. For a long time, a lot of people have lost interest. We see a whole lot of money scar online. We see the Mr. Macaronis of the world, the Sabalu of this world, the Mr. Sabinos, all of them. I mean, how can we have the original, the return of Baba Jasko? Well, that's, I think that's good for the producer. Mm. Mr. Wale didn't get to say, okay, we should you know, come back and the court always, 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 so that people will know and all that. So it's not my own, eh? because I cannot produce Papa Jasko on my own. Mm -hmm. It's not possible. That one is uh, left for the WAP. That is why I don't get production. Production. Hmm. Let me ask you the next question. A lot of people want to see your face on products, and uh, this is for the corporate Nigeria uh, product makers and all that. People want a situation because a lot of artists of your age and new ones are going on endorsement spree. Is it that you are too difficult to get for this endorsement or you are too expensive? Why are mm. you so scarce on products? Well, I am praying for endorsements too. But if it's going to happen, they want to use Papa just go there. And they need to get to where they are doing there. If you have to use that character for anything, because it's a, it's a registered character by Walla Dinka Productions. 
and uh, there's no way I can just put on the costume and all that, put the glasses and begin to showcase Papa Jasko without his consent. It's going it's only a consent. So maybe many people or many companies have gone to him and he turned them down. I don't know. It's just that I, think I can't begin to beg unless, unless you want to use me and then my face will still be there. I won't put on the costume, put on the glasses, uh, that type. So I can't, I can't do it. But there's no way. Um, my face is still there. They will still know it's Papa Jasko. You know? Mr. Uh, uh, Wala Dimga told me something so, someday and said, Papa Jasko, that time we were running good in Charles Lotto. Okay, yeah. In uh, uh, Kedjade. Calling draws and all that. Yeah. And he called I and Pa James and Aliko. We were all there. And I said, Oga. Oga now said, Ah, you, you are trying to, Papa Jasko, Pa James, you are trying to cut corners. You don't want us, people, you don't want me to know that, you say, Papa Jasko, uh, you put on this thing, I put on cap, uh, this uh, face cap. I said, now said, what of that face? <laughs> <laughs> and I laugh. I say, ah, oh God, the leave the face alone. <laughs> <laughs> we are trying to cut corners to let people know because we have to do other work now outside. At least to survive. To survive. It's not a Papa just go alone. Now people will call us here and there. But, but people that will call us, we really want to use that character because and i think i think that should have come with a large it, it should be something from him philosophical large-heartedness and thank not you hard 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 it's not that we two we don't cut corners but we will not use anything that you know uh, belongs to uh, or that will appear as a uh, papa just go and all that to do some other job hmm. so at times when i do skits too i will put on cap I said, don't remove my cap because that head has mastered me. <laughs> Even if I'm not doing anything, I still maintain the Yes, it's, the your, shape. it's, it's the shape of your, I'm it's taking, your, it's your haircut. Mm, it's natural haircut. It's, it's natural, so there's no way. And, 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 the, and, the, and the, the chemistry. Let me just tell people, I need endorsement. I need, I need their help too, at least for productions and all that. So that one can keep going. Hmm. Uh, in this world and in, in this uh, industry. Hmm. That's a fantastic one, sir. Uh, uh, I wanted to also, before we go on, is there anything you want to tell a whole of viewers all around the world, Africa, America, the European countries, Australia, from Nigeria to Ghana to Sierra Leone to uh, Swaziland, to Liberia, to Moravia, everywhere, even to Cuba, to Brazil, where we have Yoruba people. What do you want to tell them about Richard Abedo Ayoyinka, the original Baba Jasko? Hey, first of all, I want to thank all my fans out there, you know, from abroad, from uh, African countries, uh, Nigeria, uh, and the suburb areas too that I really want to appreciate them for being there for me anytime. What happened last made me realize that my fans really loved me. I, I shed tears when the thing happened and I, I begin to receive calls and I said to myself, ha! This is love. There are people like that that they don't care about. But children and all that, they will say, I'm about to get my area. They don't. I, before what happened, happened. I, I knew that my fans, they love me, both children and adults too. And then what happened last, will now show me that, wow. In fact, I want to thank them very much for being there for me, for appreciating me. And they don't want bad things. Not a good, bad thing like this to happen to me. 
it really taught me a lesson mm. of my life. I want to thank them. And I want to thank the company too. Mr. Well, I didn't get that uh, what uh, production. production. They are the owner of the character that I'm interpreting. Interpreting that I put on my head today. And from the beginning, I vowed to my God, I promised my God, I will not spoil this game. And I kept on going like that. Even if I don't have money, I don't have anything to eat, that name, I cherish it a lot. Because that name paved way for me anytime where I go to, where I do that. You know that they will say there are advantages and disadvantages. Yes, of course. Yes, sir. The advantages I enjoy. They are like uh, privileges. Thank you. Papa Jasko. So my fans, um, I'm okay and I believe nothing will happen to you too. Amen. Good children, yeah. mommy, daddy, uh, directors, commissioners, uh, even the governors Amen. and the president too. Uh, because uh, what happened that time, you know, it's the social media. Yes, sir. I know the whole world, these people shaped the whole world because of Papa Jasper. It's not supposed to be like that, but we thank God. What will be who? Be. But if this had been you, how do you think the world would have taken it? Still the same way. Mm. Even more, more serious than that. I, I don't know. Well, I'm not dead now. How can I be saying that? <laughs> if it had happened, I don't know what would happen next. <laughs> well, I must have gone, so I would not know that. But we thank God that we are all still alive. It's like Mr. Pemu, we won't be fine. Um, uh, May is a gentle soul. Uh, uh, how do you put it? Rest, rest, rest in peace. peace. Yeah. Uh, rest in peace. It's gone now. Mm. The question you ask, yes, sir. what is happening? He doesn't know. Mm. It's behind him. Behind him. Once you pass or uh, you go, nothing. At the back, nothing. Alayi Mashaye. Alayi Mashaye. Yes. Mm. Mm. I think we're going to go to the room. You're alone. Oh, see. But to much you are, and you are relevant, mm. you should always thank God. If you are alive and you are relevant, you should always give thanks to God. Yeah. Always mm. thank God. That's Yoruba for you. If Yoruba, Yoruba, I like my people and I like Yoruba people. I don't want anything to happen to Yoruba. That's why uh, I always say that even this uh, election that is coming, yes, sir. sorry for going there because we are all Nigerians yes, sir. and we're here. And I said to myself, when I see two people, three people discussing about, you know, who's likely to become a president. I know that. They will say, people will say, this one, this one, this one. I always tell them. Mm. Like people will say, they are Baba Jagaban, say, me look on. Fine. You're Baba look on. Whether it is Kinikon, a Kinikon, a Yoruba man should not be going against Yoruba man. It's not done. It's an ethnic country. We know how they also behave. We know how the Yoruba people behave. So, whether the man will do it or not, let him get there. Let us support him. That's my belief. Hmm. So let him get let's there. Let's press that let's one. Okay. <laughs> hmm. Now, now, now. Uh, before we round up, Mufe, I'm a bit of my fake key. If he a day you but we are shy, you but no need. On to be in jail, you know. Papa just go, who Papa just go, who ah, but I do belong all of it. Papa just go, who? So now, I mean, what I think by going here, but hey, you know, unless you are, you kill every so far when you're in a local, I want to bat it in. See, one more, be little more canny, see, one thing, 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 one
bawo ti le be so fun omo yoruba jaki jadu ile yoruba eh omo yoruba je ko jaki jadu abi abi jaku jadu no ni jaku jadu ni ba ni ya se fe ba ni se inu mi dun o gidi lopolopo mo gbo yoruba dala I'm a complete Yoruba man. Um, <laughs> You're from a. Um, um, say, you want to talk to him? Omo, Ogun State, let me. Me para remo. Me para remo good. Eh, inu me too. Me bakuba. Ti, I want Yoruba egbe me. Ben sa. Ti want ba ni fe koto nsi. Hmm. Oye ki o ma dupe lo omo. E yon lo ma bi esoke. Ben sa. You know, Luma lie, Molly. Mm. Human being, eh? He jot about tea. Jora Luju. Hm, along the Maka Jora Luju. Oh, boy, Len. Hm, La La Turuki. Tebapa multiple example. Your bar, your bar. Tobashi, your baba nifel, lunifel, don't bar. In your cutters or your camas or your bar. You already let it be a DB Giga. There's a lot of people who didn't love it. I go one from Boo, you say, give me a telebasubasu. One lie, Molly. In your name. Better me dupe. Pure little long for me. But one way, yummy. Oh, your face, all of your face, all of me. A me, Biraga. You are doing what you want me for me. Along with your body, me. Alhamdulillah, 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 you are sure. Who did to to Shelley? Lassie, who me you I am a young guy. I was a great to share money. Kenny, the killing book went on so. I did out to my so beginning and so. Any woe, you know, I quick or quick, I have a winning kinnico. Since I want your body book watch what was all. Benson, who think you about it, Dalla. Benson, you remember my two two bashes. Is Rusha said you? Oh, tell a warning. Hm, is Rusha said you tell a warning? I mean, just go on to more fair on me, what to pay you. Would it to pay for long? For long back or so. I'll then do pay for long be as good. I know. Back or so. I'll then do pay for long be as good. I know. I'll then do pay for long be as good. I know. I'll then do pay for long be as good. I know. I'll then do pay for long be as good. I know. I'll then do pay for long be as good. I know. O de bo stop e o bo le ni gbo ata wa laye yi na inu mo tu la wa inu mo tu ni be ni load lati osodi si yanapaja ni o yanapaja la gbe body ti wole ha o be si pe keja airport eh lazy ki dropping en to ku ni gada olo Inu eno ni driver wa inu mo tu eno ni driver wa o ti e o yato. Bobu e ro wa le ti bolle to lo ton to ngo lo furi bagi. Bata si kubati to. So so in any position in life, kulu e madu peni. Kulu e madu peni. Kulu e madu peni. Kulu e madu peni. Kusato mo shi. Afolu alugbo. Olu alugbo, olu alugbo motors. Company driving. Olu alugbo, kuzi ndo moto long. Ore mi kono, owa studio me ni si. Timo likui, mu le manzo ngolo olu le me. At John J T P T P. Olu le mje kari jai. Ami, ami du mali, ami, ami jesu. Iye akpa kono olu wa. Apa kolua? Eh, o polisi nisi. O gal. Me mo vendo pelo pelo po. O bobo yoba, yoba tu, yoba lá né? É yobi. É bobo yoba, é como yoba. 
and you come from this. A warm money to the jelly was in my mura. A common was in Shunjan to your Jawaju. A common lecoli. You bark, you will like you. You book one won't obey me. And to one more to Louis. So then be a wedding, you ban. Come by, say, yeah, you bark, my man, darling. Only a toy bear will lie. No one no feeling like a shiny. Who then beat you by no batum to your machine? I a cany for you. Oh, my jato. You'll buy a niasha, a nipple boy, a needy to me tomorrow. In the mafriquay, you want to watch the yuba, and the matter of matity, boy, you bar. On va dire que les gens ne sont pas là. Ils 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 ne Nipa ise ijojijo ilu lilu ijoju ya ni a lot that e ri ori tagi e ri ori tagi our competition not one of that one that's during our fest national festival of arts and culture that we showcase our cuisine and all that you know the traditional food culture yes traditional furnished apartment and all that all these things we have experienced but i'll just employ every period Kau mau ko atau mau ni lalang tu to ati cuye. Kau mau bashi no? Kau mau bashi no? Kau dah masih segi? Esok mau dukai, dukai kalau woi. On 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 the very last note, sir. In you in English, you are said in Yoruba. Just give advice to people in 2023. We're into a year of election. What do you want people to expect? What do you want people to do? And what do you expect from your industry? The uh, the art industry and how should should they enjoy their life in 2023, sir? For your fans all over the world. Yeah. Uh, this year, year 2023, year of election. <laughs> And I just uh, want to advise Nigerians to please come out and vote for the best. So that the best, and I know the best, we have, we offer something good for Nigerians or for Nigeria. And my advice is to please be cool and calm during the election. Anything like Ulabalu, Pandemonium, please just go out there, do your vote for anybody that you want to vote for, and then get jelly, go back home. And then, well, we will try to because uh, damsel uh, communications, uh, we've done something like that too, that we advise people okay. on the issue of uh, the peaceful election. Uh, peaceful election. And, and cohabitation. That. Uh. So that's just that. Uh. And Nigeria will be good. And I pray for all my fans and Nigeria and Nigerians that come 2023. We are going to have a peaceful election and it's going to come out successfully. Amen. And God is waiting to give us the best president. Amen. In Jesus' name. I want to thank you, sir, for the first and foremost the honor to be around. It's a very, very golden opportunity. We have mm -hmm. never seen this before. And uh, for viewers all over the world, we are thanking the great man, Mr. Richard Abiodun Ayoyinka, the original Papa Jasko. The man that God has destined to make a lot of influence in the art industry, a man of impeccable achievements, 
a man that is full of knowledge, wit, tact, and comic relief, uh, you know, comic relief material. So, till the time that we do meet him next, there are some numbers of his agents on the screen scrolling. If you want to reach out to him in any form, maybe you want to congratulate him, you want to engage him, especially people that want one or two things in terms of business engagement or creative engagement in UK, anywhere in the world, you can call those numbers. This was screening the first video and the second video. So please try to relate and continue to encourage, continue to appreciate, and always be on the side of the truth. Like he has advised you, be peaceful, be gentle, be creative, be innovative. And be futuristic. Till the next time we see the opportunity to be with the great man, I want to say Happy New Year once again. Thank you. God bless you. Goodbye. Bye.